Now that we have our wheel of life and core values, let's set some goals. In this template, I'm using the 3MIQ method by Vishen Lakhiani for Mind Valley. If you never heard of this method, then just go to the first page, watch the video, read the difference between means and then goals so that you know why are you doing what you're doing in this template. Okay, when you're ready, go to the second page. Here you also have a step-by-step -step guide exactly what you have to do. But in a nutshell, you have to write everything that your soul desires in three different categories. So first one is experiences. So all the relationships, friendships, adventures, and environment that you wish to have. So from traveling to a nice home and the car, everything goes into this category. In your growth section, you have to write about how you want to grow in the future. So how your health will look like, how your intellectual and skills will look like, your spiritual life. Okay. And then in the third category, how you want to contribute to the rest of the world. So what career you want to choose and pursue, uh, your family life, how you, how you would like to help your family and friends, your community life. Okay, so here, this is a more creative process. What you have to do is just start writing. Like, for example, how would you three spot that? This is right now my dream car, okay? Write and list everything that you want to achieve okay then grow i'm just writing a couple of examples Okay, so here you have to write everything that you really wish. So it's very important for you to let your soul speak. Don't, don't try to write something that others might expect of you. Okay, and here you have a tool that you can use to be sure that what you are writing is an end goal. So for example, you could write something like, uh, I want a new job okay and if you think and you put the question why then you will find out that i want a new job to make more money and why do i want more money is to travel more or maybe you want to buy a new house Okay, and when you can go further with the whys, then it means that it's an end goal. When you finish listing your end goals, then we can go back and go to the third step. And here you will see all the listed core values. Okay, and what you have to do is to make it nice. Okay, add the cover image, uh, add the areas of your life. Okay, so for example, this is um, friends and family. If 200 is health, it's also health. Okay, so select the areas, add the cover image, and write some goal details. You can check my examples here. So these are my real goals that I set like a year ago or two. You can see how it should look for you too. Okay, and when you're finished with this, then we will set our means goals, our smart goals. These means goals are more like milestones. These are the smart goals. Okay, so 
these should be very specific time bound these are the routes that you will start working on so for example if i want a new house then a means goal could be save up twenty thousand dollars before moving okay here also you have to create new goals and just add the due date select the end goal okay maybe add projects to it and start working so this is the goal setting part my advice to you is to use these videos so watch these all the attached videos because that will explain to you the step-by-step -step process and the why behind this goal setting method okay when you finished we will go to the template setup 